Maguire. Oh, he's got it! You're telling me in order to get this card, I've got to do 24 sets of SBCs? What do you think I got octopus arms? <laughs> Alright. What's up, boys, and welcome to the Championship League SPC featuring the Preston powerhouse himself, none other than Sean McGuire. Now, before we go any further, I do want to say, given that it is December 31st, 2019, the last video of 2019 is an emotional one. This card looks very, very good. Uh, emotional for a couple other reasons as well, man. I just want to I just want to thank you guys for uh, for tuning in over the past decade. We're ending the decade here in, in, in 2019, going into 2020. I've been doing this since 2013. Um, we've had a bunch of ups and downs. We've, you know, we've gone through uh, things you know whatever professionally and real life and stuff like that and and you guys have stuck by my side uh the entire time so for those of you guys watching that video right now for those of you guys watching the video right now man i appreciate you guys i just want you to know thank you so much uh for the support over the past year for the over the past decade uh and let's see if we can let's see if we can break some records let's see if we can, can do it for another 10 um and yeah just want to say thank you guys for for the support on the channel over the course of the years and hopefully you guys have a great safe and great uh, New Year's, and hopefully, uh, like I said, safe. Hopefully, you guys have a great New Year's. Hopefully, you're spending it with uh, loved ones. Uh, and if not, come by the stream later tonight, and you can spend it with me. Or you can spend it re-watching all my videos. But uh, appreciate you guys. Thank you so much. And uh, like I said, be safe out there huh? on New Year's Eve. But today, we're not going to be safe at all. We completed 24 League SPC sets to unlock this Maguire. I think it cost something like 250,000 coins. If I'm like remembering all the things that we sold, I think we, we sold our Del Piero. We had something like one. 1,100,000 coins and we're now down to around 840,000 coins so whatever that difference is um, we spent uh, you know it wasn't it wasn't cheap this card is not cheap uh, especially some of the stats that you look at uh, namely the three star three star weak foot the the three star weak foot three star skill moves combo obviously if you're getting yourselves a striker at this stage in the game you want one of those but you guys will know that we love Yusuf Polson even in January and February when he got that man of the match card and he had three star three star so we're gonna see if maybe there's a little bit of that Yusuf Polson magic in this Maguire card. But like I always say, boys, if these episodes help you in some way, shape, or form, figure out if you want to complete this SPC and get the card or swerve it and just enjoy it through the uh, through the channel, drop a mad lad like on the video. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button down below. So it is a 435 total in-game stat upgrade over a 71 silver card. A massive, massive upgrade. Um, it's an emotional card for a few reasons. You guys will remember last year we had the PFA uh, Player of the Year, uh, PFA Championship Player of the Year award card, which was an 82 Maguire. This is, I believe, the highest rated Sean Maguire card that we have ever had. He had himself, you guys might remember back in the day, he had a 64 rated team of the season card all the way back in FIFA 17. Uh, and what a long way he's come. Look at him. He's got 98 pace, 84 shooting, 88 dribbling. Now, this is where the stats get kind of nuts. He's got seven, I believe. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight 90 plus rated stats on this card. There's icon cards in the game, and like obviously I know he's got 49 free kick accuracy, 68 long shots, so there's a lot of cards that aren't 90, but he's got more 90 plus rated stats than a lot of end game cards in the game right now. Namely, 99 acceleration, 99 agility, 99 balance. You guys will remember the ab rating, acceleration, agility, and balance. He has got the perfect acceleration. He's got the perfect ab rating. I don't think there's another card in the game that has that. 91 stamina, 78 strength, which is even really interesting. Um, the ball control, we've gone ahead and we've jacked that off with the sniper chem style. The finishing is 99 as well with that. Uh, the only thing that I'm a little bit concerned about is the fact that he's got the 81 shot power, which I'm not sure how that's gonna, you know, we, we like to have a, we like to have our strikers with a little bit of shot power in the box. So we might have to go ahead and we might have to jack that off with a chem style. But, um, now link ability is another thing. Championship, obviously there's not great players. Team of the year is around, you know, team of the season is coming around the corner at least a few months away, so uh, that ruins any possibility of him getting a quick link, and when that comes around, he probably might even get himself uh, a team of the season card, so this card might be obsolete by that time, but uh, I could only imagine what a freaking 88 or 87 um, Sean McGuire card might look like, but we've got some icons. A lot of you guys have been asking about Nakata. We're going to try him. He's going to have his own dedicated episode as well. Laurent Blanc, we're going to keep uh, we're gonna keep using him in-game, and then, of course, that first owner, Andrei Shevchenko, baby Shevchenko that we got uh, from our baby icon SPC. We're going to see how he rolls out which actually is perfect timing because that gets our sean mcguire up to 10 chem 
Let's get into match number one with the Sean McGuire card. I've got the League SPC kit on. Match number one, vamos. He's absolutely rapid. The mad lad himself is absolutely rapid. Come on, Sean. Nakata showcasing that shot power. Now, one of the knocks on his card is his attacking positioning and then also his, uh, his attacking positioning and his finishing. But he didn't show- dude, that finishing looked pretty damn lethal to me there. And we don't- I don't even think we have a chem style on him that- that Jax is, uh, that Jax is finishing off. God damn it. My first half thoughts on this Sean McGuire card He's, he's rapid. Like, you know when you see a card with, like, stats, you're like, and then you get him in game, and he doesn't feel like he really lives up to the hype? There's all, I mean, like, look, in, ter in terms of sprint speed and acceleration, he, he damn better feel fast. And he does. He feels absolutely rapid. Best defender in the game. There we go, boys! Sean McGuire, bro. It is the year of the Kents. It is the year of the James Forrest. What am I playing? Shevchenko, I almost want to give him negative reviews for what he just... Dude, he completely... Chevy, don't be jealous that an 84 is 10 times better than you, dude. What was that? What, do you think I got octopus arms? Nah. Come on, bro. Well, I don't know if we're going to take points off for that, but we got, I feel like we got to have that. Nakata. Yeah, it's that 70. It, that might be that. That's that 77 finishing right there, dude. After match number one, I guess I would say color me impressed. We showcased that uh, we showcased that top end speed, even in the 80 plus to, in the 80th plus minute, he was burning by his defenders, was absolutely ripping through his defenders. So that's the one thing that stands out about this card. And it's the one thing, let's be real, that should. 99 acceleration, 96 sprint speed. He gets himself a goal. He gets himself an assist. What do we get for dribbles completed? 13 out of 24, 21 out of 24 with Chevy. Um, and Nakata was very good as well. Absolutely blasted one of those opportunities through. I wasn't expecting it, to be honest with you. I saw at the last minute that it was Nakata, and I was like, wait, he's got 77 finishing. And before I knew it, it was in the back of the net, and it felt, uh, felt very, very good finishing. Sean. Okay, you want to know what? You know, that's in the goal, but that's that's in the back of the net, but that's got to be in. Clarence Seedorf, the attacking positioning, he was there at the perfect time. That's got to be in. There's no excuses. Beautiful little piece of build-up play there between Nakata and uh, and Sean McGuire. But there's, there's no excuses. Time. Well, there's a long ball through, and Jim oh Park's my god, through. an insane goal! I've just seen the most insane goal I have ever seen. Where was this Sean McGuire card when we had those volley objectives? <laughs> Where the hell was this Sean McGuire card when we had the volley objectives, bruh? Go on, Nakata. Go on, show ya.
Like, I feel like most players, and like, right, that could have been a one-off, but I feel like most players get sucked into that abyss. He just literally freaking jet-rocketed out of that. There we go! Does it need the, uh, 81 shot power? Apparently he's good enough. He's got the 90 plus finishing. He now has the 84 composure, I believe, with the sniper chem style. And Sean McGuire up to his third goal in two matches. There we go. See, I think he thought I was going to body faint because I've done a bunch of body faints in this game setting up for that very moment where we literally don't do the body faint and then just rip the shot off. And Sean McGuire, the Preston powerhouse. Now, I know there's a lot of guys that watch the championship in here. I know there's probably some bitter West Brom supporters. There's probably some bitter Leeds supporters. Um... Wait, Leeds. Isn't that guy from Leeds? That was just lazy. That was laziness on my part. I didn't even... You want to know what that was? That was me being so shocked that I actually got through on that and I still maintained possession of the ball that once I got in the position to score I had no idea what to do I froze there we go that is not a lack of composure that is the Hattie for shoddy Maguire come on boys what a hat trick that was too Nice little one-two pass between him and uh, and uh, uh, Andrei Shevchenko. And then Sean McGuire, I'm not going to lie, I was just sort of expecting him with, with, the, with the composure that he has. I was sort of expecting him to miss that. All right, so Sean McGuire, I believe, gets the Hattie in that match. Yeah, he goes up, to collect, uh, goes up to collect his game ball. Now, here's the main question, right? It's a very expensive SPC. So if we're going to go on over, again, a 435 total in-game stat upgrade. So that's all well and good. But if we look at the active challenges... That league SBC is 271,000 coins, boys. Quarter of a million coins. Obviously, you get some pack value back. We'll rip the packs, all these like little silver and, and mixed player packs on uh, on stream tonight. Uh, some could even make the argument that Phillips would be the better option for leads, obviously. But um, Sean McGuire's card is just nuts because it's literally it literally caters to our body faint meta. And uh, I, I, I gotta say, for value, it doesn't really appease to me. There's so many other cards that you could pick up for a quarter of a million coins that have at least a weak foot. Uh, probably not a lot of coins that you're gonna be able to pick up with that stat combo of the near perfect ab rating. As a matter of fact, the perfect ab rating 99 acceleration, 99 balance, 90, 90, uh, 99 acceleration. For me, value, it's gonna have to be three out of five. Again, the League SPC is just hell of expensive right now. It's almost, it's just over a quarter of a million coins. But in terms of on the pitch performance, there's a unique set of stats. Obviously, we talked about them already the perfect ab rating uh the finishing the the fact that you don't really need that crazy shot power on the card we showed that with the uh, sniper chem style i am going to give him a four out of five but i am at the end of the day going to give him a thumbs down only reason i give him a thumbs down is because there's so many other options in the game that are tradable uh that you don't have to sink 250,000 untradable coins in however if you're a preston supporter if you're a fan of the championship and don't support any of the rivals of preston uh you know there's a chance that you maybe do this card just to have a little bit of fun that is gonna do it boys the final episode in 2019 hopefully you guys have enjoyed thank you guys again for a decade of support near decade of support on the channel hopefully you guys have a safe and fun new year's eve celebrate smartly don't drink and drive unless it's water then that's fine or gatorade or whatever but anyway all right uh hopefully you guys have enjoyed i will see you guys in the new year tomorrow for the first upload of 2020 first upload in the new decade hopefully you guys have enjoyed if you did drop a like on the video if you guys are new to the channel hit that subscribe button down below till next time my bros choose later ade